Welcome to this short video shot at Alton Park in the late 80s or early 1990s. I spent a lot of time at the Cheshire Race Track back then. I shot a lot of video and took plenty of photographs. But recently I was converting some old tapes to digital and found the recordings which we're looking at now. Most of my race pictures I detail meticulously, noting down dates, drivers, cars and camera settings. But this particular video I don't seem to have done so and I found the video cassette completely unmarked. I've kept all my programs from back then, the last one being from 1990, when I went to see the touring cars in action. The racing shown here is not from that event. It's a mix of Formula Ford, sports cars and saloon car racing. I was filming mostly from the avenue looking down towards Cascades, which is actually not a place that I normally go to. I used to like filming from Lodge Corner or looking down towards the pitch straights. Anyway, let's watch the video and see if we can identify some drivers and some cars. Alton Park has three configurations, a 1.654 mile circuit, a 2.5361 and the main circuit 2.76 miles and they're known as the Fosters, the Island and the International Circuit. 
Alton Park is close to the village of Little Budworth in Cheshire and occupies much of the Alton Park estate which comprised in the 18th century a manor house, formal gardens and farmland. It was later converted into a park which of course is now the site of the present race circuit. In the Second World War the grounds were used by the US Army under the command of General Patton prior to the Normandy landings. The Mid Cheshire Car Club developed the racing circuit in 1953, the first layout being 1.5 miles and over the years the track has been extended into its present configuration. Formula 1 cars competed for the Gold Cup and the last proper winner with a Formula 1 car was Denny Holm in 1972, although there have been other uh, historic and uh, other Formula 1 races uh, there since. Car 62 scene here is one I've seen before. I shot it with my Olympus on the 4th of April 1987. Dave Forster drove his MG Metro to second place in his event on that day and I'm guessing that's him in the video. Number 56 I snapped a few weeks later on the 17th of April 1987. That was Gary Wilson in his Lenham Le Mans Coupe. Once again, I'm guessing that's him in the video. Hope you've enjoyed this quick look back to the open park of the 80s and 90s. If you enjoy my videos, why not subscribe? Find out more, visit stevigginslive.com.